There's a bird of prey sitting on that post stand now. And I certainly do hunt more than birds of prey on the Royal Sandringham Estate Killing Fields. That's a Prince Harry, Edward Van Customs. They did shoot two very rare protected birds of prey on the Royal Sandringham Estate Killing Fields, Hen Harriers in flight. And they were reported by the Prince of Wales staff at Sandringham, members of the public, but then when questioned about the incident, and there it goes, they're flying off now, denied all knowledge of the incident. Even though that was blatantly them, they were the only two shooting in that area. And they certainly do hunt more than birds of prey on the Royal Sandringham Estate Killing Fields. 17 year old sex traffic gal, abused and hunted and found dead on New Year's Day, their high royal blue crime. Blue murder, and certainly not mine. It's a kestrel. So, like I say, plenty of high crimes, and certainly not mine. No Roy White and White Van Man, Christian B here, no red car. Michael Dunn, Michael Sands, Sutcliffe, Steve Wright, Wayne Cussons, that one's got E.T. on it. Prince of Darkness, E.T. Hybrid Host, Red Dragons. You can see Prince Harry the Spare for details. Prince Harry's birthday present, pie. Rich Boy's Loft, pie. Human Hunt and pie. That one had box on it behind it, so a lot of people certainly like to box me up one way or another. Stop me exposing the truth. Their High Royal Blue Crime, Blue Murder, September Blue Murder, and certainly not mine, no Black Panther, Sandringham Serial Killer here. But invariably the truth always comes out, so there's plenty of truth coming to the surface at the moment. Epstein's Devil Island, Paedophile Island, New Year's Day, names released. Horrendous crimes committed by the rich and powerful, celebrities, sex trafficked children, young girls. UK's Devil Island, castles, manor houses, UK country estates, human hunting, feasting, blood drinking, harvesting adrenochrome. Sex trafficked children, young girls, women, the homeless, hunted, abused, sacrificed, eating their organs, drinking their blood, harvesting adrenochrome. It's a very good video on YouTube called Satan's Children where a young girl did escape from the big Freemason fraternal satanic cults on the UK's Devil Island and experts who have listened to her story said that she is telling the truth and also in the Rains list it's all about satanic ritual abuse on the UK's Devil Island and it's correlated or collaborated by victims, witnesses who do not know each other in different locations, who can name the same people in the same locations, and that is disclosed in the range list, how they wear claws to claw their victims. So I say one big Precision engineered black box serial killer frame fix assassination in this Norfolk UK still with seven monster lies and seven bogus diagnoses. That one had eight on it, 18 on it, so 18 black Zs in this in the past to push their big monster 666 serial killer frame fix assassination out into the public domain. We did mark up the hardcore in this. Sending death threats full of monster lies posted through the doors, left on cars, phone bo phone calls from all the phone boxes in this, full of death threats and monster lies. I've certainly heard all the monster lies in this. I've had them shouted at me, phoned to me, posted on social media, written in death threats. So I know all the monster lies in this. I say cut and break pipes, loose them wheel nuts that nearly got me killed. There certainly are some vans you will not want to disappear in the back of. 
This post office did get the biggest black set in spray paint. Painted me very black. Serial killer black beyond recognition. And like I say, no one who we marked would press charges for criminal damage, i.e. a bit of graffiti. Face me in court at Fetford with the press there and back up their monster lies. Death threats, phone calls, cut and break pipes, loose them wheel nuts and then he got me killed when I lost a wheel of a fully loaded milk float, float at Falvern. Nearly put me in the path of a lorry coming the other way at 50 miles an hour and I was doing 40 miles an hour. So that would have been a 90 mile an hour head on impact I would not have walked away from. Now, no one would press charges and face me in court with the press now. I never had £21,000 to clear my name, not certain anyone. Mr Rowlands, who later became a judge, could judge a character, said, Johnny, you've got a very good case of character assassination. Show him all the death threats full of monster, serial killer, paedophile, rapist, ripper, black wizard, terrorist, shooter, fire star, Drug dealer, hoax bomb sender, woman beater, monster lies, which is never the case 39 on all accounts, Africa, Dis, Norwich and Sandring. Mr. Rollins, that's say who later became a judge, said, could judge a character, said, John, you've got a very good case of character assassination, we'll be glad to represent you, but just uh, clear your name, not certain anyone, not about money, just to clear my name. People can destroy your good name with monster lies and bogus diagnosis. They certainly can and will destroy your life. But he said, you don't qualify for legal aid and you'd be looking at least £21,000. And that'd be triple or double or triple that now. It's like the postmasters who were falsely accused of fraud and theft had to turn their lives into a living hell, 20-year nightmare. That's fought for over 20 years to clear their names but this post office Royal Mail postie assassins vigilantes postie mayor past and present can see Clive Howard Noble Whites and Co Elliot and Co of Mr Elliot is still around Lloyd Long Watkinson Baxter and 17 on it you know, they are the big super spreader carriers. Certainly have infected everyone. That's why this post office did get the biggest black set in spray paint. Say so no Norfolk Bacon SS, Sandringham serial killer here. Not me leaving the body of a 17 year old sex traffic girl in the heart of the Royal Sandringham State Killing Fields. So for a bit of graffiti in this, marking up the hardcore behind the big hate campaign and the big 666 Monster serial killer frame fix assassination. 18 black heads in spray paint. I walked right into a big police saw trap, denied a phone call. Solicitor of my choice, Simon Nichols from Belmore Solicitors in Norwich. I was told that no duty solicitor was available. He broke every home office guideline for a person under arrest. Under arrest for criminal damage, a bit of graffiti in this, 18 black heads in spray paint. And then my first ever meeting with my GP, Mumble and Mary, Dr. Hume, who some people say had a drink problem at the time. <coughs> Excuse me, it was suspended because of his drink problem, that's what people say. You know, my first ever meeting was him, was with Dr. Hume in a police cell at this police station. Lasted less than a minute and then he signed my detention into maximum security. Solary confinement, a forced drug at the Norfolk Bacon SS pork farm, Dr. Death's Black SS pig sty. That's a cruise on my frame, fixed tail, licensed to kill and make a problem disappear. Other car had Jaffa on it. That's why I did go to Africa. Jaffa and his yard again, threatening to burn my mother alive in her car the next time they saw her. That one had B and seven two, seven monster lies and seven bogus diners. And like I say, 
Framed and detained, Norfolk Bacon SS Pork Farm, Dr. Death's Black SS Pigsty Maze. They put more bogus diagnosis on me than on any serial killer, paedophile, rapist, ripper, black wizard, terrorist, shooter, mass murderer that you can mention past or present. For a bit of graffiti, 18 black sets in spray paint. They certainly buried me alive down the longest, deepest, darkest, blackest hole where all the monsters are, but I did escape. And that's certainly why you have to run. I say no dish shooter here, gun or run. You certainly will pay to make you disappear. Plenty of guns for hire, so sometimes innocent men really do have to run disappear go for all the right reasons before you do get boxed up or locked up disappeared for seven wrong reasons and again every like a virus has a starting point been a lot of talk about the origins of COVID where it really started from that was all covered up <coughs> and every Precision engineered black box serial killer frame fix assassination also has a starting point, a very big black cornerstone that came out of Africa, Kasumu, Kenya. And so the reason I went to Kasumu, Kenya, Jaffa and his yardie gang threatened to burn my mother alive in her car the next time they saw a real evil saw trap. Genocide on the horizon, Rwanda, just the other side of Lake Victoria. And the slaughter massacre was relentless. Mass graves you could have put the population of Dis into. People hiding in mass graves to avoid being massacred. And people dancing with fiendish delight in their victims' blood. So a genuine emergency. The danger of threat was real. God confirmed I was to go and to go urgently. Not one penny from anybody. But a lot of big monster lies came, you know, came out of Africa. As to why I'd gone to Kasumu, Kenya, that was the starting point. So, anyhow, God bless, take care.